I don't know how to introduce this guest. Like, I, I don't know how well to package it, but I'm just gonna say okay. it like this. Can I try? Yes. Can I try mine and then you'll try yours? Yes, go ahead. Okay, um, tell me to name a planet. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> name a planet. Mimi Mars. Oh. My answer is Mars. Yours is so lame. <laughs> my intro, I feel like my intro is better. Okay, try it. Let's go. I listened to her EP Well, I'm riding in the whip and I feel like sometimes I'm that girl she mm. sings about because she's naughty. Yeah. She Ooh. leaves the dudes. And she gets back with him. Nim Toto Hodari, Ataki Kuguswa. Like, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. But I feel like that's the best way to intro her. She's definitely a songbird that you need to look out for in 2019. If you were not checking for her in 2018, 2019, she should be on your playlist. Like, Kami, Kami. A huge shout out to Mimi Mars. How you doing, darling? Welcome to the show. Karibu, Karibu, Karibu. I feel like I should give her just the real tea that I'm a huge fan girl. And there's somebody in this studio who's a huge fan fan boy used to send her a lot of DMs she was thinking that? it was you like she, you responding and she, he she, didn't know <laughs> he didn't know it was like management <laughs> <laughs> he was like I knew it yes. Lord yes. I shot my shot and it actually <laughs> went through Mama I found her <laughs> so as much as we want to chop it up with you um, about your EP uh, The Road yeah. I just want to say this uh, I think we should just welcome you the right way onto True. the show okay. we have this amazing cup in front of you it's yeah. just a plain white cup I see it and it has questions. I see it. So mm -hmm. you can pick two questions. If you choose not to answer a question, we brought you your drink of choice. Oh, yes. You can Woo! choose to take a on shot. On the rocks. On the rocks. <laughs> Pan the rocks. Pan the rocks. Or you can choose to pick another question. <laughs> so you, you need to choose which way you want to go. You Which way would you like to go? Mm -hmm. I, I pick one first? Yes. 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 Okay. If you don't want to answer it, you take a shot. Do I read it out loud? Yes. Yes, yes, yes you do. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. What's the one thing people are obsessed with? But you just don't understand why. Yeah. One thing people are obsessed with. Okay, I'm, mm -hmm. I don't understand why people are obsessed with uh, Game of Thrones. Like I think. Thank you. Good. That's oh, okay. exactly it. Okay, okay. That's, that's just it. it. I, I just don't understand. I, I don't like, understand. Like, like, don't realize that the world is gonna stop on April 14th. For we, don't we don't no. care. We don't care. We don't care. It will no. affect you in some we way. We don't care. No. no. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Oh, I know, no, Next question. <laughs> Next question. Another one? Yes. Mm -hmm. Alright. Mm -mm, I don't trust you guys. <laughs> hey. What's the most memorable gift you've ever received? Uh-huh. Um, I think it was a jersey with my dad's name at the back. Oh, oh nice. Yeah, I, I, I love that. Okay. I love that jersey. That yeah. wasn't so hard. That was and the warm-up. That was, Ooh, that was easy. Small. I feel like this. <laughs> hey. hey. <laughs> so I need to understand something. Which road was this that you were on that you felt like ni mwache, that you're mtoto hodari, ni guse, and, you just and I need one night? Yes, you know? and then she's like, I need one night. Like, mm -hmm. what was going on? Which road was this? Mm -hmm. I mean, I think it's my whole journey mm -hmm. ever okay. since I started being in relationships, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, from the first relationship to second, third and fourth, you know, evil. So, and then also my friends and family that surround me. So I'm like, ah, guys, mm -hmm. I need to do something about this. Yeah. So I just put everything in every song. I wanted everyone to have a song for themselves because I know I have wild friends. <laughs> 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 I have wild friends. So uh -huh. I wanted everyone to have a song of their own on the EP. Okay. Yeah. And you only collaborated with two artists. Yes. As opposed to actually having more collabos. Yeah. And what was the choice behind that? Um, I've not been a very, I mean, I'm not very collaborative. Yes. If that's the word. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, uh, but, and that's a big complaint. I've been getting a lot. So that's the plan for 2019, mm -hmm. more collabos. But, um, I just wanted a few collaborations because I really wanted the EP to be more about me and people to hear my sound and different things I could do yeah. with my voice. So I didn't want to take the focus out of that, but I didn't want it to be too boring as well. So mm -hmm. I just had to put a little spice on it. 
I really, really love the productions Thank on you so much. all of the um, songs. I, okay, because I really, really listen to the EP back to back to back to back. Oh, so I really man. love the production because I feel like it's like bongo, but like with extra vibes. Yes. Like it's a 2.0 kind of splash. Um, were you part of the, were you sitting uh, with the crew to make the beats or were the beats sent to you and you were like tweak here? How did that all happen? Um, I think the zone, I think the only song that I wasn't, around when the beat was being made was uh, one night oh really yeah because okay. um Kagwe is the one who made the beat and he sent it over to nice. me mm -hmm. and then i did what i could on it but every other beat i was there present and i had a few changes made to it mm -hmm. and just moved it to what i wanted it to be anyway i just want to say i'm uh the one thing that I'm very mm. curious was how did you pick all the songs that needed to be on the EP? Like, was it a difficult task? Because you only had, what, seven songs? Seven? Yeah, it was yes. supposed to release seven yes. songs. Yes. And then it was just a tough decision. There were so many songs. I had 12 songs I had to pick from. Mm -hmm. And I was just like, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Wow. Like, which one? And then at the end, there was one song that was not even supposed to be there, but it had a huge argument and people just said it would just finish the set of the six songs. So. Which song was that? Um, Dogum Dogum. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. And everyone was like, no, 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 that will add like the flavor to it, you know. And funny enough, uh, back home, that mm -hmm. is the song that's actually really popping, really popping you yeah. know. So yeah. I'm like, what? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and um, can I just ask you this? Recently, I was going through your gram mm -hmm. um, and I saw you put up a, a video of you talking about. Uh, Taxi drivers, or Uber drivers. Can we just talk about that, Mimi Mas? Just because mm. I, I felt as if when I watched this video, I saw the real you. I swear, what I was happened? so mad. What happened? <laughs> the people that just, you know, you could wake up in such a good mood, mm -hmm. and then you call your. Yeah, I don't even know if I should mention the company's <laughs> yeah, name, just but the cab guy. yeah, the yeah. cab guy. Uh -huh. You know, you call the cab guy, and then <laughs> directing them to come get you or call him in such a situation. Mm -hmm. I'm like, dude. Can't you just use your map? Yeah, you know, yeah, like, for me, Jamani, how did you get this day. job? Yeah. Hey, uh. And then the worst question is that, Unenda Wapi? I'm like, yo, everything you're asking me is on your phone. Oh, Can you not read? <laughs> It's so frustrating. Usually yeah. I have such a good day, but mm. once I enter those cars, they might just flip my whole day and I'll be so pissed. <laughs> and I'm short I'm so yeah. short tempered mm -hmm. when it comes to such people because I'm like, yo, this is your job. At least be professional and like, yeah. you know, you don't care, yeah. like Funny try and start. It's yeah. very few drivers that I find and I'll be like, wow, can I take your number? <laughs> can you yeah. drive me every day? Everywhere. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Which yeah. brings me to this question. Mm -hmm. Um, as a person who's built this brand. Mm -hmm. Right, have you ever felt the need to really trash a brand online and you're just like, I don't care about the consequences that come with this, I'm just gonna go in? Have you ever like experienced that? I, I do that a all, the all the time. All the time. <laughs> and my sister, my sister, yeah, my sister, my sister is just like, Yamani, yeah, where, where? I'm like, but you know, it's, it's, it's a say that majority people are talking about. It's just yeah. that, you know, I'm not gonna only use my social media to promote my music. I'm mm -hmm. also gonna talk about things that I go through yeah. as well, which I'm sure other people go through as well. Cause yeah. if you look at that post, mm -hmm. there was so many comments yeah, on it true, and yeah. everybody had and something everybody to can talk relate. about. Yeah. Yeah, yeah true. I was like, you know, we're always showing people all these nice, nice things that, you know, <laughs> let's like <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you know, and, and those are the posts that get the most response, you know, so I'm yeah. like, yeah. True. Um, and today on The Vibe, we were asking uh, people who are listening in, uh, what's one lie your parent frequently told you? One lie. Yeah, because here we have that lie of uh, I was number one in class, all yeah. our parents were number one, they walked to school. Also, you know that? Eh? African parents. African parents. Use that <laughs> Do you think there's one lie uh, that your parents maybe told you when, when you were growing up that you believed? Ambayo umefikiria sayuko like, mm mm. Mm. Ah, ile, ah, mimi nilikuwa sina mambo ya mchumba, sijui, mpaka nimemaliza shuli, please, come on. Please, 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 the lies. Please, the lies. <laughs> <laughs> wow, thank no. you very much. So, no, I wanted should to... we get back into it? Yes, mm -hmm. we need to get back into the mm -hmm. warm-up. Yep. It's a kikombe. It's a kikombe. Ah. Do you think this is the time she's going to pick up the crazy what? question? What? No. no. Yes. 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 Just so you know, I'm crazy too. You oh, know? Okay, oh, now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, All right. the crazy. We, we're okay with it. <laughs> if you were to switch bodies with your favorite celebrity, who would? that be? 
I have three now, so I don't know. Oh, okay. Who? Who Jennifer one? Lopez. Oh, wow. Tiana Taylor. Okay. okay. Ashanti. Oh. <laughs> that is Ashanti. You got me on Ashanti. Yeah, yeah. Ashanti. I can take Ashanti's body over you with your other two. Oh, no. Sheesh. Sheesh. Next, yeah. question. Next, Next question. Next question. Oh, there's question. a again. Yes. yes. Jamani. You Jamani. haven't said no to anything so far, so you're okay. You're good. I'm trying to respect myself. Oh, hmm. based on your song One Night featuring Kagwe, Ooh. let us know what's one thing you should never do after one night. Yes, I think this is the question I wanted to be answered. Yes, he, is, he was very thing? curious about that based on your album. I mean, give me mm. peace, sorry. What's one thing you should never do <laughs> after feelings? a one night stand? First of all, don't even take the number. What? Let's yes. just start there. Don't like, call them. Don't oh, call really? them. Don't mm -hmm. text. It's one night. Yes. Like, can we just go with the definition? <laughs> like, that's oh, it. Yes. That's it. Wow. Okay. Mm, like, even if it was that good, you're just like, hey, suki, suki, suki. Suki. Yeah, I already, yeah. I I already decided. <laughs> Which that's brings it. me to this question. Did you write your own lyrics to the one night record? Or did Kagwe do it? Um, no, no, no. Uh -huh. I did. Uh -huh. I wrote my lyrics. Okay. I wrote my lyrics. Do you ever co-write or do you have like uh, songwriters who come on always, board on your team? Always. Always. Okay. I believe in working with so many people mm -hmm. because I believe two is better than one. Yeah. And also because, hey, my Swahili kid is in a chenka, you know. Really? I, I, yeah, I, I just know how to blab, but when it comes to <laughs> writing lyrics that actually make sense, yeah. Yeah, I need people who would actually do that. So I would give them the idea yeah. and then would go to the lines and phrases and everything. So yeah, it's always a teamwork situation. Um, yeah. Just one more question. Um, I, I want to know about your your workout routine and how Ooh. you oh, wow. and everything. Do you take it there? Eh, man, I, I I watched some videos on her IG and I saw even your uh, the person you work out with. Yeah. And I, I want to get first if I want to be your workout partner, Mimi. Yeah. Like what, what, what I gotta have? Like <laughs> what, what I gotta do? Just come to the gym. Just be there the gym. at nine. Don't uh -huh. be lazy. Yeah. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Fine. Um, is fitness is a big deal right now. So what are some of the things that you do? Um, maybe before the gym or after the gym just to cool off or before you work out is there something you do I can't see this I can't see this one yeah, oh, this. okay so <laughs> after yeah, after? Okay. after is there after. something you do after uh, I'm, I always run for juice Ah. always and then that holds me because I'm usually at the gym from like 9 30 to like 12 okay so like my whole morning is at the gym okay and then after that once I have the juice mm -hmm. or maybe my gym partner always brings like pineapples or maybe watermelons okay. so if we have that I would like you know I could go the whole day without eating and then I'll just have dinner at like 5 30 12 and 6 and that's it ah, is, are there playlists do you listen to yeah for sure we have different ones every day uh -huh. but we like listening to that young DJ from South Africa his playlist is which so... young DJ the, the young kid the young kid uh -huh. Yo, uh -huh. his playlist is so dope okay. I'm gonna check him out I you haven't. should yeah what? I, well I've <laughs> I know of him. I just haven't listened what? to his mixes. Judge me, girl. Judge wow. me. This is a fair. Man. I don't. I don't blame you. <laughs> oh wow. Now, uh, Neville has been trying to make me sh uh, make me understand why we mm -hmm. need to derail Mimi Mars until 9:20 in the morning. Yeah, like, man. Nah, nah, I'm feeling nah. as if Mimi Mars is feels at home. She feels at home. So, so, she's, she's the only person who can answer that. We can't speak about okay. her in third person like she's not here. Mimi. Now, um, every person usually has like a couple of their favorite records that they've ever put out mm -hmm. that they don't mind singing over and over. You, you can say you have somewhat of a body of work. I mean, yeah. you're still building on it. Yeah. Which one was your favorite projects or favorite records to have worked on? Niguse? from mm -hmm. the EP uh -huh. yeah because it was so random I was at the studio doing a session for somebody else that I was collaborating with mm -hmm. okay. and then we were done at like eight so the, it was the first time I ever met the producer his name is Dre mm -hmm. and he's like yo um if you have time if you're not going anywhere can you listen to a few of my beats so I'm like yeah, yeah cool so I sat down and he started playing the mm -hmm. beats and I heard the beat for Nigusi I'm like look I don't care. I'm not going home to sleep. Let's yes. record this song now. Yeah. Nice. So I think I think that's the most spontaneous record, recording session I've ever had. So I think mm. that that should be one of my favorite songs. 
Cool. When it comes to, because um, I'm pretty sure you're going to start working on an album soon. Yes. Who I'm is freaked out. The, why are you freaked out? Ah, <laughs> oh, man. Why? Like, There's so much pressure yeah, on the word album. Like, album. <laughs> yeah, Jamani. Mm. Yeah. You know, so I'm, I'm taking it slow, you know, probably in the next two years. Nice. I mean, yeah, if you're going to work on time. an album and you don't collaborate a lot, who are some of the artists you would collaborate with on your album? Wow, um, I'd really, 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 really search mm -hmm. and get and hunt for Burner Boy. Oh wow, <laughs> yeah. that would be a Burner Boy. Real yeah, thing. I will hunt him down. Yeah, you know? like till he actually accepts. Cause I've DM'd him. Mm -hmm. I've sent him a song that I wanted him to jump on. That mm -hmm. that was actually supposed to be on the EP. But you know now all these superstars. Yeah. <laughs> but you have your sister who's the superstar. She's the plug. Why are you Why are you not hitting up your sister? Well, no. because she's like, you know, figure it out on your figure own. Figure it out on your own, you oh, know. Wow. And I like that, you know. Yeah. I wouldn't want it to just be handed over to me, you know. Mm -hmm. I want to have a story. I looked for this guy for like yeah. something years, <laughs> and then it happens, and here's the song, you know. So yeah. I feel like you and Shay Shay would do a really major record together, West versus Shay. East kind of thing. I feel like it would be a fire, I really, nice. really, fire. really like yeah. Shay Shay. So ichoki kombe, ichoki kombe, usichi. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> What's one thing you saw on the internet this week that made you laugh? Hey, there's a video of this couple, you the girl in Kenya hey. and the guy from Uganda. Hey, Uganda. Hey. Hey. That meme <laughs> is amazing. Hey! <laughs> Wow! wow. Hey, yeah. Your, your yeah, I've yeah. been here for a whole week, you know, yeah. so I have well, to keep up. <laughs> you may scare me to Vindi, but that was the top of the list. Top of the list. It was so funny. Mm -hmm. There was a guy with no teeth laughing on that meme. I'm just like, <laughs> yeah. like, even if it doesn't mm, Gabisa, that was the one. That's the magic. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> you have to answer that. That's the one. That's the one. Woo! Read the last text you got from one of your rapper or artist friends. Hey! Where is the Hennessy? So you're gonna take a shot. It can't be that bad. Let her take a shot. It can't. You know, I go back home tomorrow, right? Hey! Ooh, I was just passing by Kenya. So, so because I don't like to expose people, yeah, man. Yeah. But maybe you it could have been like, hey, can we collab on that record? If it was that, I would probably say it and not kill <laughs> myself <laughs> with a shot. So the last message was a raunchy one, even though I talked to them. I said, I need to pick the next one. If you could make one rule that everyone had to follow, what mm -hmm. rule would it be? Yes, let me be Ma's rule. Be real. Be real. That's, that's so easy. Like, I feel like not as easy. You know how many fake people there are in the world. <laughs> or no, I'd give a challenge to the ladies. No makeup all week, and let's just post pictures forever. I think for me it would be like girls should always be okay without a flat tummy. Like it's not. That hey, easy. sister! I'm just gonna stand for this one. Woo! She yeah, can post something about that as well. well. Yeah. Time flat hey, Buana, I'm like, I'm tired. You always have to just not breathe when we're taking pictures. Suck it in. Uh -uh. Angle. No, 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 no. So let's get back into the music uh, wow. real quick. Yeah. Um, do you feel the pressure as an artist to actually understand digital sales? Much more of the business side of music now because a lot more um, artists are investing into their music. They're owning their masters. Yeah. So do you feel like as an artist, you have to really invest so much more in learning about the business in, uh, with music? Yeah, you have to, you know, I mean, because sometimes that's really just one of the major sources of income mm -hmm. you know the more views you get the more followers people will be looking at you mm -hmm. to advertise their stuff or if it's you're getting money through views or whichever and it's very hard because you know you have to there's nothing stressful like waking up every morning and having to talk about the same thing asking people to do the same thing like yo go to my bio listen to my song go to youtube watch my video you know but you have to keep doing it because you know that's how you're gonna spread your music mm -hmm. or your work and that's how you're gonna get the income and people are gone because you know now there's these awards that youtube give for having like a hundred thousand yeah. followers yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. you know so you wake up every morning you're like i want to get to that you know i want to mm -hmm. do that you know i feel like it's another i mean as in for me i feel like it's another achievement in my journey you know okay. so you just have to constantly be like it's so pressuring because yeah. there's that thing where you know ah, you see these videos and like ah, people are getting a million views and you know you're like yo 
the task mm -hmm. the work and then on the side you hear people are paying to get those views so you know it's yeah, it's very it's discouraging crazy. it's very yeah. crazy it's very defeating yeah but you know you know you know what you're doing and you just have to keep pushing till you get there you know so yeah, yeah. Well, I want to say it's come to the end of the oh road. Oh my goodness. Ooh. This is where it ends. Till the end of the road. Why are you guys not singing with me? Because <laughs> wow. you, you're the vocalist. Uh, I gave my worst voice for <laughs> no. you guys so oh, we can sorry. all go together. You got this, girl. I I don't know what to say. Why? Because you're going to say thank you. Thank you so much for uh, coming through. Yes, thank you for coming. Uh, we're so glad that we were the last interview, the last stop for you as yeah. you're heading back home to Yo. 255. Five. You know, but in the meantime, between time, we want to say for any time you will have any new records, any new heat, you know how to hit us up. Thank you. And for those of you who have may not have listened to her mm -hmm. EP, go ahead and plug it in one time. Yo, guys, um, first of all, social media, let's get yes. with the program. Yes. You know, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, mm -hmm. it's Mimi underscore M V R S 11. That's Mimi Mars. And then my EP, The Road, is available on every music platform that you know. So whatever music platform you're using, just uh, search me, Mars, The Road, and you just find it there and every other music that I have released. Well, thank you so much. Do you feel like you want to do one more warm-up question? Well, hey. I don't smile. Oh, okay, That's one more question. That's, That's the spirit. spirit. One more question. One more Come question. Come on, last one. For bonus. Culture. Bonus. Bonus. What does it say? What would you do if you were in an elevator and Rihanna walked in and joined you as the elevator went up? I'm like, please adopt me! <laughs> <laughs>